In the river, these water passes much longer stretches to the sediment, so the microbes have time to also do a biological cleaning of the water and not just a physical. And these sediments of the river are called the liver of the river because it's the river's organ to clean the blood of the river. It's water flowing on top. Now I have an experiment for you, and this experiment will demonstrate how the riverbed sediments clean the water. We start with coarse gravel, and coarse gravel has a potential for some physical filtration. It means it can uh, retain some leaves, so we need another sediment fraction. It's the middle sand fraction that is already able to retain and keep back some smaller particles. And finally, we use some fine sediments that can hold back very small particles, including, for example, microplastics. And this is now our sediment water treatment plant. And we will now demonstrate that this easy sediment treatment plant, we have some dirty water here, muddy water with some particles inside, will be able to at least roughly clean the water we have. And you see that the dirty water we put in on top is cleaned now. In the river, this water passes much longer stretches to the sediment, so the microbes have time to also do a biological cleaning of the water and not just a physical. And because yesterday we did an analysis of the hygienic water quality, and I know that the water is okay. I dare to have a sip. Katsua. <laughs>